kindness, which I'm hoping this man gets very, very soon. A small act of kindness can go a long way. Video of a Philadelphia police officer lending a helping hand to children is sweeping across social media. It grabbed one woman's attention. And now she's passing it along. Fox 29's Dawn Timothy spoke to her about how it moved her. So, Dawn, did she think her video would get so much attention? No, never. She admits she had no idea. She does like to post pictures and videos on Facebook, but this one is off the charts. 138,000 views and growing. Oh, that is so nice. Tell me this is not good D. Tell me this is not good D. Bernice Daniels is driving to her sister's house in North Philadelphia on Sunday when she sees a police officer do something she considers pretty special. It made me sit here and actually cry. She's coming down 21st Street when she sees the officer pulling over to help two children who are lugging their clothes to a laundromat on Diamond Street. They had like hampers, not, not bags, not a push cart, but heavy hampers that they were carrying in their hands to um, go to that laundromat down the street. Bernice, so touched by what's unfolding right before her eyes, she has her nine year old daughter, Bree, record the whole thing on her cell phone. Oh, and he told the kids to go ahead and walk, and he's going to drive the clothes to the laundromat. Tell me that's not a good thing. That's why Bernice decides a couple of days later she has to post this video on Facebook. Every time I looked at it, it brought tears to my eyes every time I seen it. She wants to recognize that police officer. He's Sammy Brinson of the 22nd Police District on the force since 2007. You know what that officer had? That officer had a passion. He had a passion for children, not just for work and doing his job, but for children. Well over 100,000 people viewing this kind cop on Facebook. That was so nice of that officer, y'all. Look at that. Thousands sharing it, including Mark Gamble, who saw the post this morning, thanking Bernice for spreading the good word. About six o'clock this morning, I saw it, and I thought it's a wonderful thing. I've never seen them, nothing like that. That was great. That was so great. I wish I could see the cop to shake his hand. That moment was a special moment, yeah. and I'm so thankful that I was able to witness it. He didn't have to do it, but he did it. Now, Officer Brinson was not available today, but a police spokesperson tells me it's all in a day's work, that these type of things happen all the time. It's about police building relationships in the neighborhood and that most officers would have done the same thing. Ian? All right, Dawn, thanks. Great story.